Hey guys, on today's video, we're gonna be looking at Amazon Photos for your iPhone, iPad, or Touch. Anyways, let's get started. Go right into your App Store. In your App Store, we're gonna go into Search, and then from here, we're just gonna type in Amazon Photos. And that's where we can store all our pictures, just as a backup, obviously. So let's just go right into it. Right here, the top section should say Amazon Photos. However, that's just an ad. So what I always recommend doing is just scroll down, and that's your option. Amazon photos we can click on it and just click on get so right now it can tell us a little bit more about it However, let's just click on get right now once we tap on get it's just gonna start downloading now This download process will take nothing because the app itself isn't big at all Now if we scroll down we can see a little bit more information about it including the size so right now the size is only 188 megabytes now yes yeah, some apps are actually newer than others and some are really old, so they're compatible with older phones. So for example, if I click on compatible, I can see that it does require iOS 12. So any iPhone that has iOS 12 or up, so iOS 13, 14, so on, that will work. Singles with iPad or even iPod Touch. So if you have an iPhone, iPad or Touch that doesn't have iOS 12 or iOS 13, 14 and so on, then it's just not gonna work. So this is relatively a newer app. Anyways, right now we just downloaded the app so we can go on into click to open. Once we open up the app, it's going to ask you for your sign in. At this point, if you don't have a Prime account, I suggest signing up for one. This uh, comes actually part of your package at the moment. So you will not need to pay anything extra in order to back up your pictures in this app. So we go right in and type in our email and then password. From there, just click on sign in. You're going to see this message. I would just allow access to all photos because you want to back up everything here. Once you click there, you're going to see these options to auto save. You can turn that on or off so you can save them as you like. They will be full resolution and yeah, it's free since you're paying for a prime membership. So this is part of it. So it's definitely worth it. Now, a lot of you do not want this second option turned on where it uses your cell phone data. That's because most of you do not have unlimited. However, if you do, you may want to back it up using your data and not just Wi-Fi. So you can turn that on for sure. For me, in my case, it's fine the way it is. I don't want it to use my data. I just want it to use over Wi-Fi. So I'm gonna go and tap on done on the bottom. From here, notifications. You can turn this on or off. It's really up to you. And then it's gonna start backing up all our pictures right here on our account. Anyways, right now we're done. That's the whole setup. It's that easy to set up Amazon Photos. And that would be it for this video. Anyways, if you guys have any comments, questions, you guys can write down here in the comments area. Don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.